The Northwest News Team, bringing you the news from every hook and cranny of the province. In many instances, the SABC is the only news residents listen to, although those who bring them the news have become household names. Gathering news is not without its unique challenges. Sometimes people can get really angry. And bad roads conditions have made for some close calls, but not any of these difficulties or even the coronavirus pandemic could stop them in their tracks. Breaking stories and chasing deadlines is the order of the day. Another day at the newsroom, getting ready to attend to stories across the Northwest province. I'm getting ready to go to Revelo, some 300 kilometers from Mafigeng. Apart from the other dangers, like what lurks on the roads, stray animals and gravel all the way, we also need to apply some situational awareness so that those that we go to reflect their stories also don't pose a danger to us. We've been attacked a number of times, but we ensure that at all times we bring the story to you, our valued audience. SABC has 19 radio stations and our dedicated journalists make sure that they are first with the news. Itumelen Kajani was first called in for duty during the prolonged unrest in Marikana in 2012 and he has since grown with strides. The positive thing about the SABC is, like, is that unlike um, with the community radio station, because I used to work for a community radio station, you have millions of people listening to the content that you have gathered. So that's one thing that is guaranteed. However, you are not guaranteed certain things as a journalist. You live on a daily basis to go to the field to cover stories. You meet with um, hostile interviews. In the public broadcaster's 85th anniversary year, a star was born, the province's first female video journalist. Challenges that I faced is that uh, I'm a very petite, small person. The cameras are quite large for me and when I'm out there with, with other giants of the industry, they overcrowd me, but I make sure that uh, I push through. All these thinking minds in the newsroom kept the SABC's flag flying high. As we say, happy birthday SABC, more is to come as we are independent, impartial.